Here's my newly purchased Durst A300 autofocus 35 millimeter enlarger from the probably mid 1970s. It's in pretty good shape, it's pretty clean, but the key problem I'm having here is that there's either a dry bearing or a damaged part. You push this really nice lever to unlock the head and you can move it down or you can move it up and so that's fairly unpleasant. The seller um, professed to have no knowledge of a bad sound, which sounds suspicious, but it's possible it got jingled or, or damaged in transit. If anyone has ever taken one of these at least apart a little bit or maybe opened it up, I'd love to hear how you did it. There is obviously a panel right in the back that is a sheet metal panel that makes a 90 degree bend and covers the back end. There's four screws in total that hold that panel in place, but the two screws on the bottom are filled with like a putty, which my guess is Durst's way of saying, don't open this up. So if anybody has experience with that, I'd love to hear it.